Hi everyone, this is Steam21 and today in collaboration with the British Art Foundation we will be presenting our project, a central source for BHF health intelligence data. So about the project, our tool aims to automatically scrape and clean the five key data sources coming from NHS and NHS England for the BHF health intelligence team and the tool is delivered in an executable form. So the background problem is that BHF uses general public medical data to produce statistical insights on cardiovascular well-being using RScript. This data, however, comes from a variety of public NHS websites, which means they all contain different information and have different formatting. Therefore, before running the R analysis, the team needs to manually download each data file and individually clean each Excel sheet. So the user goal is to save time through scraping and cleaning through RPA. So our project goal aims, therefore, to take five sources URLs and through scraping, transform these into a input data set of Excel sheets and through cleaning to filter this general medical data into, to only obtain cardiovascular data. So, so I will now take you through the key requirements of our project. First, we built an NHS dataset specific RPA for the extraction and cleaning algorithms for the key, data, key sources. Then we have standardized formatting of relevant data sources. So this means the output files are arranged in a directory tree based on your publication and type of data source. The files are, are in appropriate machine readable format and stored locally. We have a UAT client tested UI and detailed documentation. So now I'll take you through a high level UML diagram of our system. Our system comprises of the model view controller architecture, where the view displays the GUI, the model processes the data on the back end, and the controller is the bridge between the view and the model. The model has instances of two key classes, scraping and cleaning, which use the packages scraping algos and cleaning algos to process the data. The main technologies we use uh, for scraping, we use BS4 and PyWGET. Cleaning, we use Pandas and OpenPYXL. And performance, we use multiprocessing. We will go into this a bit deeper. First, let's talk about the GUI. So here's a snippet of how the GUI works. It's very simple and intuitive. All you need to do is run the program, select a folder to save your files into, and click Run. And the whole process is done for you in the background. Okay. So how the scraping works is the BS4 uh, library will access a web page navigate around the web page, save the targeted links that you want and keep them. Then the PyWGET will use those web uh, will use those links and download the files and save them locally in a hierarchical structure. And this is what it looks like after. So that's where the cleaning functionality comes into play. The cleaning functionality is divided into four main steps. The creation of output file in XLSX format, the extraction of data from input file, the filtering of this general medical data only to obtain useful data for the BHF health intelligence team, and finally, the writing of, of the filter data into output files in a standardized format agreed with the, with the client. This happens all together through the use of multiprocessing to speed up running time. This is an example of what a cleaning uh, uh, parser looks like before, so what an Excel file looks before and after our cleaning process, so you can see a lot of data was filtered. And when we, when we talk about performance, um, from the first iteration, which did include multiprocessing, to the second iteration, our program runtime moved from 100 minutes to roughly 7 minutes, therefore increasing by 14 times the runtime run speed. So the deliverables that we achieved is, first of all, we achieved the requested functionality. We completed documentation, including user manual, deployment manual, how to expand the tool, and also information about how the code, stru the code structure. We also provide a user-friendly GUI, which was an additional feature a cross compatible Python executable uh, for non-technical users. We also provide a standard formatting of the clean NHS datasets, and also we made the code available through GitHub repository. Thank you for your attention. These are the GitHub and blog links.